Hello, and welcome to the video to learn how to configure notifications in CCH Access. Notifications automatically alert staff of events that occur in CCH Access. They are configured at the firm level and can be sent to an email address or to staff in the dashboard notifications pane. The notification dictates the type of recipient. For example, notifications for client events can be sent to client responsible staff. However, notifications for data center maintenance can only be sent to an email address. To begin, open dashboard and click application links on the navigation panel. Click notifications under firm. The notifications that have already been added for your firm display. The condition is listed first, followed by the notification message, the priority, the type of recipient, and the specific recipient. To add a notification, click Add Notification. The conditions that are available to add are listed above the notifications that have already been added for your firm. Scroll down the list of available conditions to see the notifications that are available to choose from. In this video, I want staff to be notified when data center maintenance is complete. After selecting the notification that you want to add, click the down arrow to move the condition to the selected list. Click the down arrow under Select By to choose the recipient type. The data center maintenance notification can be sent to an email address. Other notifications allow you to select staff, team, or client responsible staff. Click in the recipients field. Enter an email address. If you want to add multiple addresses for a notification, click Add Recipient. Select to add another email address and enter another address. If you want to send the notification to more than five people, we recommend entering a distribution list email address that is set up in your firm's email system. When there are multiple recipients, the word multiple displays in the parent row. You can collapse or expand the row. Click OK to save the notification. When finished, click Save and Close. Thank you for watching this video.